you know, my my dream was to was to play in Premier League. I did this for for seven years in one in the biggest club in the world. So now maybe it's time for for a new challenge. If it is goodbye, what a way to go out! Thank you very much. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. Could walk out with the armband. All the signs are that yes, this has been choreographed. And why wouldn't it be? His opponents on the day, his colleagues on the day, and those who have worshipped him from the stand are being permitted a moment to say goodbye. Didier Drogba, Chelsea legend. He's being carried off. Wow. Now that's respect. Well, that not... is universal respect. And even in the circumstances on a day like today where nothing is really at stake apart from a little bit of pride. Um, what a tribute to Didier Drogba. Five years ago, when Chelsea last won the title, he scored a hat-trick against Wigan on the final day. He will cherish that memory. He'll possibly cherish this one even more. And the man who pays his wages is applauding as fervently as those who look down from the cheaper seats. Mutual appreciation and affection. We're going to be behind you, the fans are going to be behind you, they are the best fans in the world. Chelsea's my home, Stamford Bridge is my home, and it has been for 22 years. When I first signed here as a 14-year-old boy, I never imagined I would have played this many games, achieved so many things as a player, as a captain. The Chelsea fans, you know, win, lose or draw, they're behind the team. And for me, that, that's been fundamental in our success. I kind of dreamed of, you know, you've always wanted to score a goal and just get amongst your fans and, and be, be one of them for that, that five, ten seconds and kind of enjoy the moment. <laughs> fans the hugs to his teammates this is the end of his Chelsea days mm -hmm.